Carriage Works Incorporated. Established in 1981, Carriage Works Incorporated utilizes state-of-the-art technology to manufacture high-quality billet grills, billet accessories, truck accessories, and many other customized parts for all trucks. From the time Carriage Works Incorporated produced its first part, the foundation and quality of Carriage Works Incorporated has provided the best parts and service available for its customers. Carriage Works Incorporated billet grills are continuously featured in several national truck and street rod magazines. Billet grills, American made, aerospace quality, custom, easy to install, and available for hundreds of vehicles. Carriage Works Incorporated, the original billet grill and still the best. Carriage Works Incorporated. Welcome to the install for 2007 Tahoe. These will be some of the tools that are suggested for the install. We're going to get started off by taping off the entire front end of your grill shell. Using a pair of dice, clip away all the honeycomb area. By doing this first, you save yourself from cutting away too much because you can always remove more that you cannot replace what you have cut away. Repeat the process of removing the honeycomb from the bottom grill insert as well. The next step is going to be cutting flush to the inside lip of the grill shell. If you have access to an air cutoff saw or a similar tool, it is okay to use this in place of the hacksaw at any time. Yet, an experience with such tool is necessary. Next, by sanding flush and removing any major burrs from your opening, this ensures that your billet grill will install smoothly. Next, remove all tape from your openings because this will not be accessible after your billet grill is installed. Moving along, we're going to remove all six bolts from the top of your grill shell. Placing the bolt through the welded bracket onto the billet grill. This is an example of how the bracket that is included in your hardware should fit. Placing the grill inside the opening and making sure it has a good fit. These are the brackets that are included in your hardware. Notice that they are different sizes. The shorter bracket goes to the outside on both top and bottom. Now we simply place the bracket onto the bolt that is already through the billet grill. Then we will place the nut on after that. Here is an example of how the nut will be placed onto the bolt. Now simply tighten the bracket so that it is snug against the grill shell. The top insert is done the exact same. The bolt goes through the welded bracket. This is an example of the bracket that is included in your hardware. Now place the top insert into the opening. Again. The shorter bracket, as on the bottom, will go to the outside edge of your grill insert. After the brackets are placed, we again will start by putting the nut onto the bolt and tightening the bracket onto the grill shell. And again, tightening the bracket so that it is snug against the grill shell. This ensures that it has a nice fit.
Now for the last steps, simply replace the six bolts that we removed from the grill shell and remove any excess tape that is left. Now it's time to enjoy your new custom grill.